you have weight in your account? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, you're going to have to just get right back up. Okay. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I love that woman, y'all. I really do. I love her. <clears throat> you back in? Yeah. yeah. city out in Dallas today mm -hmm. exclusive Saturdays uh, for those of y'all that don't know um, my baby has a I would say a big event every month once a month um, right now it's at Rockwood and yeah. they bring the city out yeah I'd be proud of that I'd be proud of us yeah I really do I feel like uh, I mean, I'd really be proud of just in general, like the turnout. Like, I'd be, I'm grateful for everybody that comes out, yeah. turns up, has a good time. And I just feel like it's, you know, people be like, it's for the culture. But at the end of the day, like, it's for us. Like, yeah. whatever that is, like, I feel like we don't really have a lot of things that's for us. And the fact that we have this, that people show up month after month, like, they have not let us down. Yeah. You know what I mean? In the cold. In the cold. Turn this place out today. Yeah. It was even hot up in here. But they put their big one on today. Yeah. They definitely did that. So, like, shout out to all y'all that came out tonight that turned up. Make a birthday. The Aquarius. They did they think. They did they think. It was an Aquarius takeover. Okay. I, was, I was like, dang. Okay, I see y'all. Yeah. Come on, Boba. I see y'all. Because clearly you want to get up here. Come I on. see the Aquarius, like for sure. Yeah. Everybody was like, dang, y'all skipped Capricorn. It was not on purpose. On purpose. It yeah. really was not. But you know what I mean? Like, y'all did y'all a big one tonight. Yeah. So yeah, yeah. It, was, it was it was a vibe. Yeah. So big shout out to Exclusive Saturdays. Mm -hmm. When's the next one, baby? The next party is mm -hmm. we bring in a cute. Um, red and pink party. Okay. So show up in y'all's red and pink. You know what I mean? We're a little bit after Valentine's Day, but you know what I'm saying? It's still February, so we gon' we gonna give it to y'all loved ones. Yeah. You know? That's gonna be lit. Yeah. Like, pull up. Pull up. Pull up. But I feel like this, like, tonight, the vibes was right. I felt like they were just organic. Like, yeah. everybody was in there, like, big chilling. Yeah, for sure. Like, having a good time with their people, like showing love to other people. Yeah. Like it was just all love and it's just, I love to see it. Yeah. And I love that like, we're a part of it. Mm -hmm. For sure. Yeah, for sure. It was a good night. Yeah. So uh, I guess we can get into Let's Get Deep. We don't pick up our baby. She is a baby. I said, baby, what do we have to do? <laughs> She was like, I'm outside. <laughs> she tried that like she was outside. Let me tell you, I was like, well, I'm not gonna pick up Nelly. Yeah, so baby went to go pick up baby. And I called her and I said, where you at? You just get to the party. She's like, I'm on my way home. Yeah, I was like, I'm on my way home. I'm yeah. sliding to the house, baby. So uh, it's like a date night with you at this point. Yeah. We done did exclusive Saturdays. We done, we done enjoyed ourselves. No, we in bed. No, we in bed. You yawning. Yeah. <laughs> so, let, I guess let's make Boys it quick. Gone let's too. make this quick. Okay. Right. You want to make it quick? Yeah, let's do it. All right. So, we're going to do Let's Get Deep. Um. Yeah, we just going to grab some cards. Okay. They got deep, deeper, and deepest, I guess. Okay. I don't know. The creep go outside? You want to go outside, but I think you want to you wanna go outside? Go outside? Okay. 
her bad. Come on. All right, so we done did a lot, so let's get to it. So first things first, what up world? It's your girl, Brittany. And Dory. And we are Brittany and Dory. So we are about to play Let's Get Deep. Uh, we done did enough rambling, so we yeah, got to- Yeah, you really didn't cut me out. You didn't answer my question. What were your questions? It doesn't matter. No, no. All right, so um, yeah, let's get deep. All right, baby, so grab you. Let's do three cards. Three. Deep. You want one? Yeah. I don't know. You know, I don't like you. Uh -uh. I don't like you giving me my card. I don't like you. <laughs> Why are you even touching them? Okay. Hey, lady, I want it to be my own. Let it, right. Hold on. Hold on. Big boom. Right. I'm a, see, I don't cheat either. I take what I get. Okay. That's fine. See, Dory the type to grab a card, read, and if she don't like it, she's going to go back. Okay. She's she going to grab about five, six cards. It's only deeper, deeper. Okay, but I just said we're doing three cards. Okay, so I'm going to go deeper, deeper. Do you okay. want to go deeper, deeper? Which one? You pick. It's your third card. I want you to go deeper. Okay. Okay. All right. <clears throat> what you reading the card for? Can't do that. <laughs> Why can't you do it? Let me see. Let me read it. Let me read it. I don't know where it went to. I promise I don't know. What did it say? What did it say? It was like, if you had to die today, this one. If you uh -huh. were to die today with no chance to communicate with anyone, what would you most regret, regret not having told someone? Why haven't you told them yet? No. Damn. That's You see how I slid that back in there and your nose at itself really wanted to know. All right, I'm just going to do it. My third one is going to be a D. Okay. All right, here we go. Um, You want to go first or you want me to go first? Yeah, I'm going to go first. Uh -huh. I'm going to do the icebreaker one because I'm going to go deeper uh -huh. and then I'm going to do my other ones. Okay, but real quick, I always like to ask, when you read your card, are you answering it? Am I answering it, or are we both answering it? We both it? answering okay, it. Okay, cool. Yeah, cool. They want to hear from both of us. Okay, all right, let's do it. Okay, this is. I feel like this is my least favorite card. So I'm gonna go, go ahead and get it. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Would you be open to watching porn together? Why or why not? I feel like we tried to watch porn together one time. Remember, but that it was so familiar. long ago. Like it was like we were still at our old place, oh. and like prior to <laughs> prior to me, Brittany didn't watch it. Yeah, I don't think you did watch it at all. No. Like, one day I was like, "Let's turn it on," and you turned it on. But I don't know how you really felt about it because I don't know. I feel like for me, when I used to like, I don't watch it. Like I, I never really was like a porn person like that you know what I mean mm -hmm. but sometimes like when I wanted to low key kind of just like have a moment I don't know if this is going to see the light of day icebreaker or not I don't think this is going to see the light like when I have watched it before okay. you know what I'm saying so and I don't have a category <laughs> Like, you know, 
My name is Dory. Uh huh. I'm 33 years old. Yes. Wait, no, I'm 32. No. <laughs> you you gonna fake your age? You can go to the queen. <laughs> but you are. But you know what I'm saying? Like, you between nine. Okay. Okay. No. Okay. No, okay. All right. So the next one, my question. Okay. Um, do I want? I want to go deep first. Uh, between us, who is better at keeping secrets? Me. Do you? Yes. Uh, uh, <laughs> you feel like you keep better secrets than me? I feel like, depending on what the secret is, yes. I feel like, no, I feel like it's both. Yeah, but am I a good secret keeper? Yeah, for sure. But I'm not like, I don't be talking. No, you don't. Yeah. I mean, but do we, we do talk about everything. So do we tell other people's secrets to each other? Man, they business. <laughs> so that's what I want to know from y'all. I want to okay. know. Like, like, it, yeah, yeah. Tell us what y'all be doing. Yeah, for real, like, for real. do you keep your friend secrets, or do you tell your wife or significant other or partner, like your friend secrets too? Like, is your does your spouse get like, yeah, like they go? But I feel like with that situation, I feel like it depends on the secret. Ooh, because yeah. I do be feeling like spouses be low key kind of like judging. Mm. And be thinking like, okay, uh, oh, that's what your friend be doing, mm-hmm. or you don't understand, or just in general. Like, I just feel like spouses like you can't. I feel like you can't really tell your spouses everything about your friends because mm-hmm. they gon' they gon' use that. Uh huh. They gon' feel some type of way, low key. Yeah. So yeah, that's my opinion. Okay. So I just be like, you know, yeah, you can tell your spouse, but it just has to be it has to be a little small secret. Yeah. Not like big secrets. I feel like there's certain things that like my friends might tell me that I may not share with you. Yeah. And that's okay. And I feel like your friends tell you stuff that you may not share with me. Yeah. They be thinking that you be telling me though. Yeah, they do think I tell you. I think because people think I tell you everything. Yeah. Because we're so close. Yeah. But I'd be like, no, she didn't tell me. Yeah. That was a good story. Yeah, for sure. All right, you next. <clears throat> Lose all your friends, but win the lottery. Ooh. Or keep all your friends, but don't get a raise for the rest of your life. I can bite you all over that. <laughs> <laughs> what is wrong with you? I can you? bite y'all back. <laughs> what is wrong with Lottery you? me, please. Really? Yes. Uh, I, think, uh, I love y'all, but at the end of the day, like... You gon' you gonna probably pick them friends. Mm. I love my friends. Yeah. But I think they want me to pick the lottery. <laughs> <laughs> Your friends would want you to have that money. Yeah. 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 That's what's up. Those are good friends. But I'm gonna still take care of them though. I know. You really would. Yeah, for sure. You really would. That's I, what I think. I'm like, like we got friends, but I got you boo. <laughs> <laughs> and that's just how I am in life in general though, like. Yeah. You know. But you gonna keep them friends? Probably. Wait, let me see what this said. Let me see at the end of the part said. But don't get a raise for the rest of your life. Yeah, But I, why? I just feel like... I mean, I'm hoping that if, if, I'm, if I'm making the type of money I'm making now and don't get a raise for the rest of my life, I'm good. <laughs> but what if I like these going up? Yeah, but... But I'm, it depends on how much that lottery is, though. But that's what I'm saying. I feel like if I'm making what I'm making now and uh-huh. I don't get another raise and I get to keep all my friends... You give me friends, me please, yeah, because I'm good where I'm at, and I feel like I can still like. Okay, well. <laughs> anyway, next card. My if friends you go gonna understand. My card. They gonna understand. I'm gonna take care of them, whatever they need. We just can't be friends. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. I don't know. That's really hard, though, to be honest. Like I'm a little, you know, I be joking around, but at the end of the day, I love my friends, so I wouldn't trade them for anything. But at the same time, it's a lottery. So how much we talking? Right. How much your friends not work? <laughs> Shoot. How much? How much is a lot of money? Um, one hundred million. Yeah, a hundred mil. That's ridiculous. Okay. I mean, Fifty mil would be good. Really, twenty five mil would be. Okay. Good. Well, be friend me. Be okay. friend me means to actually be my friend. Yeah. But be friend me. <laughs> <laughs> Okay. Good, I'm next. I'm going to do my next deep. And okay. I'm going to end off with deeper. So my next deep is 
Name one thing you think is important for us to do together as a couple. Okay. Do you want to go first or want me to go first? Um, you can go first. I think it's just really like what's important is spending time together mm-hmm. as a couple. Like, I think that not really more so. And I think I, I saw this like meme on Instagram and it really made me think about it because like we spend a lot of time together. Mm-hmm. But in society now and just like life, social media p- plays a big part in it. And honestly, like, really getting in bed and being on our phones and watching TV is not really spending time together. Right. It's really, like, doing certain things, like, the day when we make pizza together. Mm. Or spending time with Nelly all together or doing stuff, you know what I mean? Like, when we went to, like, Houston for a trip or something like that, like, Tiffany, I feel like those are the important things. Not the routine things of us getting in bed and kind of going to sleep or Mm -hmm. getting on our phone or watching our favorite show on Netflix or, you know, whatever the situation is. It's just actually spending quality time together and in the moment. Yeah. I'd agree with that wholeheartedly. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So yeah, that's me. Okay. Um, I will second what you said, but as far as, I guess, a different answer so I can sh- act like I'm participating. <laughs> so name one thing you think is important for us to do together as a couple. Um, I just think it's always good for us to like experience life together like it's important for me to continue to travel with you and like allow Noe to travel and for us to have those family trips like I think that is important for us to do together like that's what I grew up doing with my family like traveling going to hotels that had an indoor pool so we could still swim and just like little things like that I want to like make sure we experience like the world together as a family so I think that's the like most important thing for me yeah. for us to do. Okay. All right, your last card is a what? Deep or deeper? Deeper. All right. You already read it. I have it. What does it say? It says, "Whisper a sentence in your partner's ear that will get them aroused." <laughs> <laughs> I don't know why either. <laughs> but remember the last video, you did say you like to talk dirty. I feel like and I it's told a you that moment, you did it. You like, like, put here, me on the spot. But that's what I'm saying. That's why you ain't no talk dirty kind of person. You uh, you want to be talked to. But the eyes don't lie. They don't. Mm-mm. Mm. You know. <laughs> okay, stop and try again. Why you play so much? Well, I was serious. <laughs> I know that tickle. Okay, try again. Why <laughs> you gotta start off like that again? I'm the youngest of three, so 
I definitely feel like I do have a little bit of spoiled tendencies in me. However, I also like, I just get after it. I just do whatever. Cause I grew up watching my brother and sister do it. Like I just was always a step ahead early because I wanted to be like them. I wanted to play sports when I was too small cause they were already on team. So I just feel like I was always trying to like be where they're at, but I'm two years younger than them. So I just feel like, yeah, definitely played a part of my personality. Even the role I play right now in my family, I think is because of being like a younger sibling. And then, you know, obviously it has to do with other things too, yeah. but for I, sure. Yeah, I was, a, I was the youngest baby girl for a very long time. Mm -hmm. Until my brother came, but, um, but I was always the baby girl, you know yeah. what I mean? So I don't really know if like it played a part Honestly, like, I don't know. Like, I feel like it probably just depends because I feel like I was spoiled by my grandparents. Mm -hmm. So maybe that kind of carried on to who I am today mm -hmm. in certain ways of how I moved. But, like, I just feel like I kind of just, I don't know. I don't know how to put it. I don't know if it changed my personality, personality or what. I just feel like, no, I just say I'm who I am. I don't know if it's, like, my age or where I fall has played, like, a part in it or not. I don't know. Mm. So I don't really know. I can't really answer that. Yeah, I don't know. All right, what's your last card, baby? Okay. What is something that you've always wanted to do but never had the guts to? Uh, I'm going to say bungee jump. Mm. And it's not that I always want to do it, but I always feel like it could be like a really nice thrill. Mm -hmm. But never in my life will I do it. Really? Never. So is that why you mentioned you wanted to do maybe the sky, the indoor yeah, sky dive? Yeah, the indoor sky dive I mean, just to kind of just see how that feels and get that kind of, you know. That rush. Yeah, but like actually jumping from a whole plane? Yeah. No. And then parachute might not deploy. Well, I'm not manifesting that at all. <laughs> mm -mm. Yeah. No. But that's something that I just, I mean, people do it all the time. And they say it's like the best thing ever. Mm. And it's like this. But I, I don't have the guts to do it mm -mm. at all. Mm -mm. But I am like, so part of it is like, okay. It's not mm -hmm. the thrill that I want to feel. It's just like, damn, I just bungee jumped out of the plane. Yeah. So if I like surprise you with a bungee jump. Like a real life one? Yeah. No, you wouldn't be I able to do it. You would be like, I, waste, I would have wasted money? Mm -hmm. Wow. Mm -hmm. Okay, cool. Don't do it. <laughs> Say that coin? Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. Don't do it. Um, what's the question again so I can answer? What's something that you've always wanted to do but never had the guts to do it? <sighs> always wanted to do but never had the guts to do it. I don't know. I don't think. Mm. You don't know? I don't know. For the longest time, like shooting a gun was like something I always wanted to do. Mm -hmm. um, I'm scared of guns, by the way, y'all. You don't get that when I was a kid. Yeah, I never did that. I'm like, like in the I, country, and your uncles would like shoot guns. No, they like shoot guns out there. Yeah, they they hunt, but like guns, not no shotgun. No, you mean like just a pistol, just yeah. shooting it. Yeah, shooting it at what? At the air. Like okay, the that's country. Oh, that's the first time I did it. Huh. Mm -hmm. You're just shooting bullets in the air for nothing. Yeah, yeah, that's country. I'm like one. I don't like guns. Yeah. I don't either. That's why I just said that would have been something, but... But you've done that, though. <laughs> I did bad. You did. Early. Okay, hold on. Let me get one, <laughs> last, one last card to end it out, because that one was a blur. Um, okay, this is a cute ending. List three things you currently feel lucky to have in your life. Number one. Noah, how she gonna come for me? <laughs> I looked at you. I was like, should I say my wife's name first or say my baby's name first? Wife, baby, wife, baby, baby. I went with Noel because I feel like Noel is like number one for both of us. Mm -hmm. So I feel like you would be okay with saying. Is that wrong? No, I don't think so. I think that is like that's our new purpose. So mm -hmm. it's like it's they love to say like wife first, husband first, whatever. But honestly, like Noel is like our. Yeah, I think we both put her first. Yeah, for sure. And I think in putting her first, it allows us to put each other first too. Mm -hmm. Just because we know like if I'm not 
a hundred percent, then you pick pick up my slack and vice versa. Right. What's going on? She got to be taken care of. Yeah. So we figure out the rest, <laughs> all of our dealings, ups and downs, and all of that. But Noe, she's just living a good life right now. So yeah. Yeah. So I feel like that can be your number one too. Okay. All right. My number two is. my way okay. I definitely feel lucky to have you mm -hmm. not only as a wife like you said like you my dog you my best friend mm -hmm. you were like everything everything mm -hmm. you really are I could like go on and on of like everything you are but I definitely feel lucky to have you lucky and blessed yeah because a lot of people can get lucky but not everyone will be blessed, and I feel like I'm blessed to have you. That's lovely. Yeah. That's sweet. What's your number two? You. What? Me? <gasps> you got a number two. What's your number three? My number three. I just think I feel lucky to have life. Mm -hmm. I really do. That's like, a good one. I wasn't even thinking that. Yeah, I feel lucky to have life. Um, here today, gone tomorrow. Yeah. So I feel lucky to be here right now and doing what we're doing, like in whatever capacity that is. Whenever we do it, however we do it, like I just hope we show up as our most authentic selves, like spread love and live while we're here and hopefully y'all live in while y'all here because you ain't gonna get another one of these and that's that's, that's the crazy part about it yeah that's you ain't deep. i gotta i gotta go there that's too deep yeah i'm like you know i like to go deep why i just don't no just once for us no. like why is it what's why it's is just that? the fact of not having like this moment yeah. again you know what i mean or not knowing that to me is deep mm -hmm. so i don't like to think about it i never have yeah. Never have. Um, but my third one is just having everything that God has currently blessed me with. Mm. So that's my third one. That's what's up, baby. Yeah. That's what's up. And a lot of us get lucky. Yeah. But we do. We do. In our own way. In our own way. It's like even the fact that like depending on it doesn't matter, just the fact that you wake up. Yeah. You're lucky. Yeah. So it's a blessing. Mm hmm But yeah. You ready? Let me look at your list. Okay, let me see. Mm -hmm. All right, we're about to get out of here, y'all. We appreciate y'all going deep. Deep and deeper. <laughs> With yeah. us, yeah. literally with us. So yeah, yeah. hopefully we didn't get too deep with y'all, but yeah. Yeah, it was cute. Yeah, and I appreciate you switching it up and coming get on the couch with me after. An exclusive uh, interview. Yeah, we ain't never done this before. Mm -mm. You want to do it more? Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Usually we still might be outside. People be wanting to eat. People yeah. want to still kick it. Like this is one of those times we. Y'all see our shirt. Y'all see our what? Our shirt. Yeah, mm -hmm. about to go straight to bed. So uh, we about to get out of here. So with that being said, it's your girl, Brittany. And Dory. And we are Brittany, Brittany and Dory. Peace. Stop what you're doing, hit the subscribe button And if you've been subscribed, then you've been riding with us Ain't nobody gonna hold you down like I do Stay true to you like I do Spoil you like I do Adore you like I do Clean for you like I do Cook for you like I do Ride it down with you Ride it down with you And that's why I said I do Spring.